Hey there, Scorpio. Welcome to your reading for the week of March 26th. Uh, this week, definitely check out astrojar.com for s more awesome readers and astrologers. Uh, I was laughing at your cards, but anyway, uh, let's see what we have going on for you this week. Uh, I would say needing to go on some sort of adventure, needing to change things up at this time. I feel like saying keep the momentum going. You don't really have any cards of momentum, but I feel like maybe things have gotten restless or, you know, stale or so something needs to speed up here. Could be in a relationship, could be in a business, whatever. Um, I, I just think you just need to try something new. Uh, amazing card of marketing yourself as well at this time. So, you know, if you're trying to get a job or uh, trying to sell something, you know, really sell yourself as well. Um, because this card says you are very valuable and you need to kind of get that across to the people you're dealing with at this time. Next, you have the five of hearts needing to socialize as well at this time. I mean, it's kind of boring. All all water signs have, you know, been getting these messages of needing to get out, needing to meet people, needing to socialize. But I do think that there are a lot of benefits, especially with Capricorn energy this year. Uh, there are a lot of benefits from socializing. There are a lot of benefits from other people this year. So we really have to go get it. And uh, I think that's why these cards are coming up. Next, Ace of Diamonds, stepping off on a new path or uh, taking some sort of risk at this time. Definitely a very good card of money, money coming in. But again, it's through some sort of risk. It's through you know taking kind of uh, the the path of the path that's unknown. Uh, you know, I don't know where I was going with that, but uh, anyway, doing something that you've never done before, doing something different, innovating. It's a card of innovation. Um, innovations can be highlighted this year. Uh, Uranus moving into Taurus definitely could be some innovation, some changes, and maybe you are kind of have some innovative idea that you should try at this time. Next, you show up King of Hearts. Also have the Queen of Hearts showing up here, so it could be love coming in for you in the form of a, another water sign at some point here. Uh, this could also be you and your relationship if you're already in one, and on top of that, it could just be a friend, somebody who's going to help you. Uh, but King of Hearts is a card of the home. Again, I think that Cancer had exactly the same thing. Um, so a lot of you could be focused on the home, working from home, doing things from home at this time. Uh, this is also an amazing card for returns, things being returned to you, energy. And it mostly represents like something that you've put a lot of work in over the past like years. And you could be getting some sort of gifts or rewards from that at this time. Next, you have the Queen of Hearts. Like I said, could be love uh, in the form of a fellow water sign. Uh, could also just represent starting something new. You have a lot of ton of new energy here. Two fives, ace of diamonds. You know, those are and plus this card. They're all cards of birth, starting something new, starting some sort of new project. I would say it's probably new but old. Like a lot of you could be working on one thing for a very long period of time, and you're just constantly kind of like changing it and updating it and doing new things. Um, so, like I said, keep doing it. I'd say keep innovating, keep making changes, and I think you'll be very successful. Next, you have the Six of Clubs, the card of success, the card of putting down a burden, the card of releasing some sort of burden. So I think things are getting better for you and will continue to get better for you for sure. And this is a card of moving forward and getting things that you want. But to me, it's mostly the card of success, getting something that you desire. And finally, Seven of Clubs. A couple of signs have had this card this week. I do think that people are restless at this time. I think people are just like wanting something in their life to happen in, you know, one of any area really in your life and this is a card of restlessness but um like i've said to the other signs i think there's a lot of pressure coming in and but i think this pressure is what's going to like force us to actually make some sort of change in our lives so i do think it's a good thing just you know embrace the pressure embrace the change and i think you'll be very successful uh very shortly here without having to wait very long but looks like a good week i'd say mostly about new stuff new changes coming in or uh, needing to keep things updated in your life to, so that you can move forward. But looks good. So thank you for watching and enjoy your week.